Morning guys, Suburban Dad here. Um, I'm gonna do something here. I'm gonna talk about this whole moving to Florida. It seems like a lot of you guys are commenting. Um, like I said, look at this weather. I'm sitting out here early morning, having my morning coffee, and uh, just reading over YouTube and some of these questions. Figured I'd answer some of them by video. Now, one of the first ones I got here um, was a reader or a reader by the name of Tom. He says his family's moving to the Orlando area next year. Um, good area, um, a lot of suburbs. I mean, there's more housing developments down here in a square mile than you'll go nuts with. Um, but his main question was about utility companies. Now, if he's from upstate New York, he knows National Grid, or as we used to call National Greed. Um, electric prices were high enough and then they put delivery fees and all that fun stuff on he's asking he's having problems finding different ones down here now there is a bunch of different ones down here where I am I'm on uh, Kissimmee Utility Authority KUA um, you have Toho you have Orlando's the city one a bunch of different ones um, everything down here runs on electric um, you do not want to get natural gas for anything you don't want to get propane for anything unless um, you just like throwing away lots and lots of money um, that stuff is stupid expensive down here um, I mean getting a propane tank for your grill or whatever that's about normal you know 15 to 20 bucks but uh, propane for your house or for a stove don't do it um, everything's on electric now him trying to look it up he's probably trying to figure out prices compared to what he's used to um, let's see with National Grid, my average home electric, now this wasn't for heating, for anything else, my home electric in upstate New York averaged about, with delivery fees, about four to five hundred dollars a month. Down here, I have a whole house running on electric. I have pools, I got a hot tub, I have AC, I have everything running on electric. Summertime, highest bill, and a four bedroom two bath house runs me about 380 and it's summertime peak season right on down through wintertime I drop that right down to about 180 you're not running the AC as much things like that basically you're gonna find your I mean our utility costs dropped more than half coming down here um, it's, it's New York Tom, it's New York, man. New York is literally just trying to soak every freaking penny they can out of anybody. So keep looking up. You're going to find there's a lot of different utility companies in different areas, um, all depending on where you want to move to, but they're all going to be cheaper. Now, another one um, is Jason here. He's looking, him and his family moving Orlando Central Region area in the next year or so. They're looking at Zillow which is an online housing uh, listing. You can find rentals, you can find homes, everything else. I've used it. Um, actually, when we got down here, we were looking at it. And the house we found wasn't on Zillow, but the house right around the corner in the next cul-de-sac was. We stopped and looked at that one. And it was pretty nice and everything else. And on our way out, we saw a sign out in front of this place. Stopped, called, and next thing you know, we signed the paperwork that afternoon. So, and we're doing basically the same thing. I came from owning homes and everything in upstate New York and came down here knowing the same thing. We're going to be running around. Let's rent for a few years. And honestly, with the way the price uh, prices of houses nowadays, um, I don't mind renting. It was my first time doing it. Um, I have my chores and things, but otherwise they come by, they take care of the lawn, they take care of this. And uh, a lot of the big stuff's out of my hands. Um, you have to really look around now. There are a lot of slumlords down here. Um, get reviews, talk to the people, use your gut. Um, if something seems a little fishy, run the fuck away. Because it's going to be fishy. Um, just use your head. But there's a lot of good stuff down here. But, um, Florida. Oh, it's cloudy right now. It's horrible. I don't know what I'm going to do. I have to put my sunglasses on by my head. It's been a great time down here. Um, really, 
New York to Florida, it's a big change. Um, anywhere to Florida. It's basically if you're going to move anywhere. I was watching a video the other day of families moving from Maui to Arizona. I guess they wanted to melt. Um, but everybody gets kind of sick of where they are. And you got people here in Florida that think it's a, you know, oh, they would love to move to upstate New York. But it's a great time down here. Now I'm going to be start doing some videos. Um, me and the family went to a big flea market, Renegers, yesterday and everything else. We did, uh, I did some videos on that. Basically, I'm going to start doing some things, showing some stuff around here that isn't theme parks. I mean, if you want to look at Disney stuff, it's on YouTube all day long. Um, I love the parks. I love the mouse and everything else. But there's so much to do down here that isn't a theme park um, from just all kinds of things. So I'm going to start doing some videos on that. But to answer a couple of your questions, um, Tom, Jason, guys, it's a, it's a great thing down here. Um, let's see, another one. Uh, this person's looking in the Clearwater area. Clearwater, St. Pete, that area, you're looking at the west coast of Florida. Um, there's a lot of more money over there. Some of the home, a lot of the home prices you're going to find down here average around $250 to $350 for a decent home and everything else that I've seen out there. Um, you can find rentals and everything else. Um, but Connecticut, uh, he's coming from the Connecticut area, so prices are probably going to seem a little bit better from him. But otherwise, guys, keep up the great comments. Thank you for subscribing. I'm, I'm having a great time. I'm actually starting to get a little bit more into this. It was kind of slow at start, but slow at first, but that's the way it is. You kind of get used to this whole YouTube thing. But um, I'll talk more about Florida here. I'm going to be doing some more reviews on some just household things and barbecues coming up. Doing baby back soon. But um, otherwise, thanks guys. I appreciate it. Thanks for subscribing. And uh, don't be afraid to move. If you're going to do something, do it. Don't think about it. Don't him and haw. Well, I got to do this. I got to do that and everything else. Yeah, you do that. You're going to be sitting right where you are sitting right now a year from now. If you're going to do something, put your mind to it and fucking do it. Till then, Suburban Dad. Hope you enjoyed. Talk to you guys later.